Okay, uh, had a couple of days off uh, and in between family activities, uh, so I was able to um, make a difference on the Tesla uh, coil. Um, basically, we got the same uh, L2, L1, L2. Um, this is uh, an extra which I'm working on. Inside is L3, and uh, the top. Instead of the uh, top load here, an aluminium, I've, uh, I've just put a extra coil on there to see uh, what the results would be. So we're coming from there, from L2, uh, to this coil, out through uh, to a spark gap, and then down to ground. Um, again, L2 is directly down to ground this is the first setup um, again we got a, a fan with a 12 volt and uh, an 18 volt battery uh, Li ion battery to uh, start the wave uh, through the ZVS into L it uh, L1 sorry um, this is just an indicator LED that there's something in the system I've got a, an indicator here that there's something uh, coming through here and um, and you'll see a incandescent light brighting extremely light uh, uh, extremely brightly so we'll start it up that's the fan just to cool down and we'll set everything going that's the indicator light that's from the L3 which is in the center and we'll get the spike gap going if we can. A little bit tricky. Here we go. And uh, again, the normal field generated. that would be from the uh, top load. So nothing there. But top load, yes. There we go. Still have this back. I'll just put that in. So yeah, uh, that's just uh, what we're at at the minute. Um, so the next stage will be to take the L3 and uh, put it through an AC to DC uh, converter and have it uh, back into some caps. Um, question is whether I'm going to use uh, this cap uh, set up uh, to take from the bifiler collection coils as well um, or whether I'm just going to um, charge these up and uh, have it run. I'll use the start a battery to uh, start the setup, but uh, that's where we're at. A kind of a, a cabin nads effect, or whoever else is doing it, a, cu a cooler. But um, what I can see is there's um, we can collect from here and from inside. So there's two uh, external power sources. Uh, that we can collect from. We could also collect directly from here. If you like. Let me see if I can put that on. Yes, that's all on there. Um, yeah, okay. It's a little bit of a, a mess right now, but uh, you can see where we're going with it. Um, can also maybe extend the or improve on the spark. You don't need more than that. So yeah, uh, keep posted. Again, it is uh, in connection with the um, Tesla third energy field and the um, anti-gravity uh, videos that were posted earlier. But um, let's get this working first, loop the system, hopefully. And, uh, and we take the next step. Thanks for watching.